How are you doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Today we're going to be doing some demonstrations on the 47AG versus a professional screen paint which I ordered off Amazon. This entire wall is actually coated in that screen paint. Now, um, the art screens are using, the 47AG is using Smart Technology Gain Times 5. This is the panel version of the screen which allows you to build and piece, connect multiple screen panels together to form larger screens or designs or however way you want to do it. Now, mind you, the panels come three per box. We also have this in a 100 in, 100 in screen 1610. This is a flex surface, which means you can use it for a curve or basically a straight screen, very lightweight, easy to hang up. And that's basically about it and you're done. All right, so as I said before, screen paint, we feel the technology is old. We also feel that it's dirty, it's dull, and it just does not give you the colors that your projector can give you. Your projector is very high tech, believe it or not. Whether you're using a low entry level projector or a high entry level projector, your projector is a very well equipped piece of machinery. The problem is it can only work as well as the screen that it's projecting on. All right, so in the demonstration, we have the door open. I'm gonna show you something really quick. Usually when you see people doing demonstrations with the door open, you gotta look at the door very carefully. Usually the door will be like this. Okay, the reason why the door is like this because they want to give off the illusion that there's light coming in, but it's not hitting the screen. There's no light hitting the screen with the door like this. The door has to be pushed all the way over. That's why I got my toolbox against the door because you can see when I turn to the side, you can see my door is all the way over and there's light cascading on my screen. And that's one of the things I noticed in some video demonstrations that the door will be open just enough about right here where you see the screen starting to get dark right there just enough right there or if they have it here see where the screen is at it'll bypass the screen because the door will be this way and that's how they'll have the door so the door is blocking the light but you think you see light coming in because you see light around this opening right here you think there's light cascading and no this light is actually missing the screen so you have to push your door all the way to the very end which I have my door to the very end and you can see it lines right right out with the screen some of the smokes and mirrors that a lot of people would do to claim that the screens can take on ambient light now you've seen our screens outside they look absolutely amazing all right so let's take the projector off blank mode all right you can see already the high-tech performance of our screen with the lights on and with the spotlight. All right, so show we begin. Now mind you, the screen I have painted behind me is a very professional screen paint. I purchased it on Amazon for about $300 a gallon. Wanted to make sure if we were going to be doing a proper demonstration on, again, versus screen paint, that we got a professional screen paint and not a do-it-yourself hobby screen paint. And the thing about it, when people don't understand that, yes, screen paint is, it, next to our technology, it is a very dull and dirty um, screen paint. This is dirty. The reason why, how I figured that out, because when I did the demonstration against the Crystal Wave Technology screen versus our Platinum, I've seen how far and how advanced the Platinum screens were to the screen paint, and this is why we decided not to go back into screen paint ever again. It's just old technology. Look at that. Look how incredible that looks. Door is open and look how fantastic that looks. It doesn't make a difference how high power a projector you get. I can hit this with a 4,000 lumen projector, 10,000 lumen projector in 4K, and you hit this 47 AG and it'll blow anything out the water. Look at that. Does it make a difference if it's short throw or long throw? The bottom line is, like I said, screen paint is just dirty. It's a dirty, it's a dirty, it gives you a dirty, dull, dingy picture. 
Now, usually you'll see people do these demonstrations in a dark environment because it's the only way they can make the screen look beautiful. You want the best performance you possibly can get from your projector. Why subject it to a dull and dirty screen? Look at that. Screen paint doesn't even come up. And this is a professional screen paint. Like I said, this is not a do-it-yourself quick mix. This is an actual professional screen paint. And it shows you exactly how advanced the 47 AG is. And it shows you that our customers can have their lights on, fully lit environment, have light coming in through the windows, ambient light, and the screen is still going to look fantastic. Now, I just want to add real quick, the Future Tech is still under NDA. Um, we have only we have two screens we're not going to bring on the market, which will be the Titanium 4K Gold. Also, to the Nano Black will not be coming on the market, but the 47 AG, sorry, the 47 AG will be. Uh, just to add really quick, 47 AG. Make sure I had that right. Uh, these screens will only be available for six months. Now we can pre-order the screen right now. The launch date for this screen will be on July the 27th, 2017. If you do not have a pre-order, you cannot get this screen. After six months, these screens will not be available. That is my noisy laptop, which I'm gonna take down on Thursday to get it fixed. I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna pause it right there. All right. I'm gonna come over here, put it in back in blank mode. All right. We're gonna to go to the next section because this is a very long video. And I'm going to shut the door because we already proved that the screen looks fantastic. Yeah. Look at that. That's the light that's coming off that's hitting the screen from the spotlight. So the screen is taking on all that light from the spotlight. We we'll turn off the spotlight. All right, so this time we get it nice and dark in here. All right, we'll come over here and take the projector back off blank mode, okay? And we'll come over here and we'll knock out the lights. All right, so those of you can get a look at the screen with the lights. That laptop back there is really buzzing. I can't wait to get it fixed or buy another one. Now, just to tell you really quick, we are not even using HDMI. We are using a VGA hookup. There's no HDMI in here. It's only, only VGA only. Now, here we are with the lights out. And this shows you how advanced our screens are, even with the lights out. We can produce a brighter and better picture than the screen paint. Just look at that. Okay guys, before my time runs out here, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. I hope you enjoyed this video demonstration just showing you the advancements on our technology and why we feel that screen paint is considered AKA dirty paint because it just cannot give you a, 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 a clean and beautiful picture which you desire. You want a screen that looks like an HD TV. You don't want a screen that just looks dull and dirty. And I know when you're looking at it, 
especially when you don't have our technology laying against it. It looks fantastic, but as you can see, this is what you're getting. Just look at that. Look how beautiful that looks. That looks incredible. Sorry about that, move to the side real quick. Just gonna let this play until time runs out. And you can just see the advancement on the screen. It's absolutely gorgeous. Look at this. see how much of the picture you are missing look at that look how beautiful that looks look at this and that just shows you how much of the picture you're actually missing just think if I was using this picture it's projector and this is a lead this is a hybrid laser and lead or lead or lead or laser projector if I was using this on this screen paint this is the performance I would be getting well, not that performance We've got a commercial. Look at this. Yeah, my projector, Mike. It's really noisy back here. I'll get it fixed later on, like I said, this week. But like I said, if I was using my laser projector or my laser LED projector and I was using it just on the screen paint, this is what I'd be getting. This is what I'd be seeing. This right here on the side. But hitting a 47 AG, this is what I'm getting. So it just makes you think. Are you really getting the best performance from your projector? Okay guys, I'm gonna leave it at, I'm gonna actually drop it off here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video demonstration. Again, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Also check out our Merce 4K cinema screens. They're absolutely incredible. Our screens are just outstanding on every freaking level. Look at this. Can produce amazing contrast levels. I gotta play this real quick. Look how much brighter that is. That is beautiful. That is freaking beautiful. I'm gonna let it play a little longer. I gotta let it play a little longer. You can see even on the dark scenes, the 47 AG just produces a brighter, more vivid picture. Talk about getting your money's worth. Look at that. See how much brighter it is here than here's how dark it is in there? Look how beautiful that screen looks. And like I said, this screen will be available for six months. After six months, that's it. Alright guys, thank you all for watching.